Well, polls open in just one hour in the special election for the 80th Assembly District. The special election is for voters in Chula Vista, National City, and South San Diego. CBSA's Dana Marie McNichol is live outside Southwestern College. And Dana Marie, that's one of the places folks can uh, cast their ballot today. Yes, good morning, Eric and Netta. This is just one of nine voting centers that will be opening up around 7 a.m. this morning. So voters can cast their vote to replace Assemblywoman Lorena Gonzalez and that term that lasts until December. So there are three, three different candidates vying for her position, and I'm going to share some information about each one of them. But there is so much more information and a full interview on CBSA.com that you can catch up on if you are still undecided. Now, first, we we have Democrat David Alvarez. He's a small business owner and a former council member. He grew up in Barrio Logan and attended San Diego State University. He says Sacramento politicians are out of touch with problems families face every single day, and he'll confront our biggest problems head on. Then Democrat Georgette Gomez was a council member from 16 to 2020. The environmental advocate and businesswoman is also from the Barrio Logan and an Aztec grad. She's endorsed by Gonzalez and San Diego Mayor Todd Gloria, among others in the Democratic Party. Gomez's priorities include expanding affordable housing, reducing homelessness, as well as expanding access to quality child care for working families. And lastly, Republican Lincoln Pickard is a retired contractor who has admitted he is running as an underdog in the heavily Democratic district. He's running for the 80th district seat four times before. His campaign focuses on lowering the cost of gas, water, forest management, also repealing COVID-19 restrictions and enforcing border security. Now, voting centers include Southwestern College, Camacho Recreation Center, South Crest Recreation Center, and Montgomery High School. So again, nine voting centers are slated to open. Now, if you're unsure, if you live in the district and can vote, you can go to sdvote.com. We'll have that link as well on cbs8.com. Full interviews with each candidate if you are undecided. Uh, it's a good resource to check back on our website this morning before you head to the polls. I'm Dana Marie McNichol, live in Chula Vista. I'll send it back to you.